Hello everybody again! We're on our third Hasbro video and in this video I have a little modification that I'm doing to this shell. If some of you don't know that are adding the Alice frames to this particular Hasbro pack, you'll notice that the Alice frame kind of sits a little bit too close to the motherboard and that kind of creates an issue of it not being as screen accurate as it could be. So I took it upon myself and I went into Tinkercad and I started designing uh, a design that's as simple as it can be without having to remove all the brackets where we could just remove the top bracket, slip that spacer right in there, and create some more accurate gapage in between the Alice frame and the pack. So let's get into it and let me show you. I just wanted to show you guys on a movie accurate pack that there is quite a bit of a gap in between the motherboard and the Alice frame and that's kind of what we're trying to go for where a finger can get in between there. Now this spacer isn't going to make it perfect but it is going to make the Hasbro pack a lot more accurate. So this is the spacer that I modeled to go in between the Alice frame and the Hasbro pack. It is three quarter inches tall. And we're going to go ahead and remove this bracket and get it on there and let me show you exactly what it looks like. So we're going to remove this bracket very easily. I'm not going to be using the screws that came with the Hasbro pack because they're going to be a little too short for this modification. So these are M6 half inch screws. They're metric. They're not quarter 20 like I thought they were. So I am going to remove this bracket. I'm going to take my new spacer there. We're going to lift the bar. And we are going to center it. There we go. And then we have our bracket here. We're going to set that on top. And that goes right on there, as you can see. And then I had to go buy some uh, new screws at Ace Hardware. These are M6, one inch. Equivalent is 25 millimeters long. So the 25 millimeters is one inch okay 25 millimeters is one inch one inch is 25 millimeters that's what you want so now as you can see we have a lot more gapage we can get a finger underneath there now whereas before we could not get a finger there's how it looks guys. We didn't have to drill any new holes. We just used the pre-existing ones that came with the Hasbro pack. A very simple modification. If you guys are interested in purchasing some of these, I will put them up on my wife's Etsy store. Very, very easy fix. But you can also do this yourself. You know, you can go buy some wood, shape it to how you like. Just make sure that it's three quarter inches tall to get a very nice and correct gap there. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope it helped you out. Like I said, this is a super easy modification to do. You don't have to drill any new holes and ruin your Alice frame. You just use the pre-existing ones that are there and just make sure that if you guys make this on your own that you are doing a three quarter inch space and that you are using M6 metric screws one inch long and the equivalent of one inch is 25 millimeters but i will also list this 3d printed model in my wife's etsy store if you guys are interested please drop a comment and if i get quite a bit of interest i'll know exactly how many i need to make and i'll get them in her store for you guys so thank you for watching and we're on to the next one we're going to get one step closer each time to making this more movie accurate as we can of course we can never get 100 percent there but we can get closer and we did today so thank you guys for watching